welcome back to Let's Play Not Another Needle Contest, part 7 I wanna say? I hope I'm right about that, it's definitely been a while. So, yeah, apparently it's really hard to <laughs> focus on like both streaming and the recording of videos, especially with how little time I have during the week. But, yeah, I feel like I should have continued this way sooner, I'm super sorry about that. Um, like, when was the last time I uploaded a part of this? Like, two months ago? That's insane. Alright, I don't want to waste any more time. Let's just get back into things. And I have actually no idea where I left off, so let's check it out right here. Tier 4, apparently. Alright. So, I don't know whether I've used these bullets and this skin a lot in the previous video, so I'll just keep them for another area, and if I have enough money, I'll, I'll change. Uh, maybe get a new custom or maybe just switch it up a little bit. I can use the ones I already have, I guess. So, alright, let's move on to place... I'm bad. Place 20. <laughs> alright. 20th place, made by not even amateur, and it's called Wrapping Around, Falling Forever. The score is 7.1 out of 10. It has one secret to get, and it's a solid difficulty. 2.5 stars out of 5. Alright, so we can already see a um, gravity uh, gimmick in the thumbnail there. Some uh, Nang stars, and the Kill the Guy laser. Alright. <laughs> well then, starting off strong with the Nang reference. All screens have screen wrap. Alright, that's good to know. You cannot shoot switches in this stage, unlike other ones. Alright then, so our amazing bullet will be useless for this one. Well, not entirely, since I'll still have to shoot the saves. So, I'm pretty sure this is like, not water, right? But it just slows you down. And we have a trouble drum, okay. So let's get the switch out of the way, and we'll have to make our way down, I see. Pretty sure I had to use all of those triple jumps there. Now, I guess I just have to make it like over there quick enough. Or how exactly does this work? Yeah. Do I get my uh, jumps back when I screen wrap? Because, yeah, for sure I, I can't jump any more times than three times. So how does this work exactly? I feel like I'm screwing up already. Do I have to get back down here to touch the switch again? Well, this wouldn't do much sense. I think I just did it wrong. Yeah, I don't- I'm not supposed to jump up here and touch the switch. That was my bad. Okay, so you single jump. And then we weep down. Okay, that makes much more sense. Touch it on the way down, and now I still have two jumps I can use to hit this switch. Uh, screen wrap? Alright. It's a long screen, but that could have been it. Alright, but yeah, I'm pretty sure that's how you're supposed to keep the screen. Maybe you can actually save a jump. Wait, nah, I don't think. I don't think you can reach the bigger stretch switch with just like your second jump. I'm pretty sure you have to use all of your jumps there. So, alright, let's see if I can get back there. Something just occurred to me. <laughs> I'm, I'm actually messing up again. So, alright, watch out, this is what you have to do. Weave all the way to the bottom and then you actually only use one jump. And then you can screen wrap if you go to the left here. Heck yeah, I'm smart. Okay. Now, this allows you to actually get to the warp, I'm pretty sure. So, yeah, let, let's just do that. I don't know if it would have been possible any other way. Maybe? Maybe that would have been too precise? I really like um, how the like slow fall area was implemented into that screen. That was like, really creative already. So yeah, definitely a good, a really good first impression. And I'm pretty sure this is also the um, 
music used in not another needle game, right? Not not going crazy here. So yeah, it's definitely like a huge. Well, can, can you call it a reference? It's based upon that area. But it obviously combines some of the gimmicks with the lasers and also the triple jumps that were not there for this gravity station hang. So, where do I wanna go? Over there, alright. Still with triple jump, don't forget. Alright, this is pretty fun so far, I gotta, gotta say. Okay, that's pretty simple with the triple jump. Oh! Yeah, I should have paid attention to that. Alright. So I can't stay on the same spot there for too long. Alright, back already. So I guess I can just single jump onto the switch. Yeah, makes it way easier. How tiny can you jump with this? Alright, worked out. And the final drop, which should be pretty simple, especially since you have a triple jump. Alright, and that's that's a secret that you can skip. <laughs> okay. So yeah, okay, the screen is optional. I like that. Um. Well. I mean, I like the fact that the creator dedicated a whole screen for, for the secret. And, well, you obviously don't have to do it here. Um, so, this looks like it, it could be a puzzle though, so let's try to figure it out. Is that intended? I'm pretty sure, yeah. There's nothing else I could do. At first. Alright. Um, I guess. Wait, that, I can't go quite high enough for that. So I can't shoot them. Maybe here then? I definitely hug the wall there. Got this confusing. All right, I was I was just, uh, I was just holding right and hoping that it would work, and it did. All right. So now I only have a single drum. So what can I do with that exactly? Pretty sure... Okay, let's not forget that we have screen wrap. So this should not kill me. And I, I guess I want to go over here. Although... Can I? Ah, oh, there's definitely nothing I can do here. So, if I drop down here, I'm dead as well. So maybe jump over those? Cannot touch that laser switch though. Well, I'm already confuzzled. But jumping up should... or well, it shouldn't. Well... If I had a double jump, that would work. But I, I'm not too sure how to do that with a single jump. Well, I'll, I'll have to figure out a path for this. Um, oh no. What? That worked? Okay. Sure. I. Okay. Uh, let's not mess this up then. Um, yeah, this. Okay. We have a triple jump. <laughs> That's new. Um, Alright. So. But I'll still have to touch this laser button carefully, which didn't work out, but okay, at least, I, that was so weird, I just thought of that option, was like, that's not gonna work, but <laughs> apparently it's not too bad, okay. 
I gotta say, for, for me at least, like that was that was quite tricky to figure out. I'm pretty sure I sat here for like more than three minutes, <laughs> like just staring at the screen, questioning what could be done differently here at this part. But yeah, the, the um, low gravity makes that like an option. Alright, let's please do this right. Okay. So this should allow me to go up this section. But not like that. <laughs> Wait, what did that do? Oh wait, there's screen wrap, I forgot. Okay, but that maneuver was also pretty tricky. This this screen is difficult. Alright, uh... So... Pretty sure... That has to happen. That was really close, almost hit those buttons there. Um... Now... What has to happen? Is, is that it? Oh, that's gonna be tricky as well. Okay. So... I don't wanna mess this up. This looks right though. There's even like a double jump replenisher. I mean, could I could I go up here? Pretty sure that would work as well. And that that's scaring me. Why would that work as well? Wait, um, turn off that laser, re-jump into that laser. You know what? I should <laughs> I should not have went for that. I, I didn't even realize that. Oh no, I just beat myself by. Not doing what I was meant to be doing. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> hey, I did it right. For once. So, yeah, this. See, this button is moved up. So, it is actually possible to do the, do the maneuver I, I was trying on, on the left there. But, yeah, okay, that was really unnecessary of a death. So, new stuff, new stuff. Nice. Wait, I'm done! What? How am I done? What's the section on the top right for it then? Or were there like multiple paths you could take? Or I cheesed it? Whatever the case, whatever is the case, I'm, I'm done. I feel like I'm done. <laughs> okay. Let's move on then. I don't know if I solved, uh, if I actually solved it though. But I mean, I'll I'll take it. I'll take a victory. Uh, okay, so this is a little bit too high up, so I need to go down here first. I forgot about the fact that I just have a single jump. Okay, so you can go quickly here. Nice. Two jumps. So I didn't pay attention to that on the previous screen. Do those replenishers uh, reappear? I'm gonna say no since that's how it worked in uh, Nang. So what would I have to do here? Okay, this is not high gravity. But do I have to save some refreshers? I'll just try to save the very bottom one. I feel like that's my only option here. There we go. Oh, that's what's gonna... Well, <laughs> I couldn't save it. Alright. But yeah, that, that answers my question at least. Of where I'm supposed to go. Alright, last 
challenge here. I died to a gate, what? Ah, uh, I deserved that one. There we go. Alright, next win. The, this area is really unique with it, its level design so far. Really like the use of, of these gimmicks here that we've been introduced to so far. Okay, this section is kind of weird. It, you you fall fast or slow depending whether you touch the floaty liquid at first or not. I mean, I don't want to call it water since it isn't. I think I'll, I feel like I wasted a jump there. I want to keep my jumps. That transition is screwing with my head. It's just a drop though. Ah, okay. Well, I didn't look where to go. That's good. Let, let's do it again. Until we figure it out. <laughs> okay, I feel like that was right. I do get my jump replenished. But I would have a third one. So that means after I collect the refresh, I have two, right? But I'm pretty certain that I'll... Do I have to? I don't know. I'm not quite sure. I could jump to the switch. But then I wouldn't need a final jump. Oh, let's, uh, I'm sure it's just gonna work out. <laughs> if, if I get there. So yeah, I'll have to use my jump there. Okay, that, that explains it. Yeah, I'll have to use my final jump to hit the button, switch up the lasers, and well, then, then I should win. <laughs> there we go. That was... Ultra close on that final spike. Oh, nice! Even your uh, bullet screen grab. <laughs> All right, so I can actually. Oh no, that's not a block, just a tile. Oh. All right. So yeah, that that was this area. I really, really enjoyed it. Um, final screen felt kind of awkward with um, the stuttering for some of the drops. I feel like, especially that like one. Uh, 16 pixel thingy, but it was it was fun overall. And yeah, the the secret for this area actually kicked my butt a little bit <laughs> with how I could actually figure out where the hell to go. <laughs> but it worked out in the end, and I maybe even took a shortcut because I don't actually remember um, accessing the area on the top right. So I don't know what that was about. But yeah, finished it and. That was enjoyable. So, another space area. And let's check the review for Not Even Amateur, written by the judges. Pretty fun design for the most part, and the theme works well. The secret room is great, and while only one or two of the judges could actually beat it, we all agree that it is impressively made. Well, it definitely was impressive with the, how the path worked for the screen. Must have been really complicated to actually come up with something that works. But yeah, as I mentioned, um, I want to know if the path I took was the intended one or not. Because uh, I was about to say, like, um, it's also impressive that there there were no skips involved, like in that like entire screen. With like how many combinations you can, or possibilities you have really with the triple jump and all the lasers you can go through and whatnot, but 
Well, anyway, <laughs> I'm glad I got it. I'm. I beat some of the judges with that. <laughs> um, all right. So yeah, pr pretty fun. So let's move on right away. Um, next area, place 19. Um, this was made by Bab. Whoa, what? <laughs> okay, I, I have no idea how to pronounce that. Sorry. And well, this area is called Cosmic Evade. So will it be another space themed area? We shall see. Score is 7.2, so pretty close to this one, right? This was 7.1? Yeah. Out of 10? Ooh, quite the step up on difficulty. So, yeah, 3.5 stars out of 5. One secret to get, which I'll look for. And. Alright. Already really impressed by the graphics for this. This, this looks amazing, <laughs> actually. Okay, so the lasers will kill me when they're like... or not? Oh wait, no that's actually just the gimmick. <laughs> Never mind, okay. Yeah, that, that makes more sense. Okay, that's the speed gimmick. I gotta remember all everything this game has in store. <laughs> I don't, I don't feel like there's a need to go through the whole tutorial though anymore. Like, I should be used to almost all of these gimmicks. Alright, I think I just jumped too late there. So does that mean that this area focuses more on killer blocks instead of spikes? That'll be also interesting and something that I think wasn't done in the game before. Yeah, I can see why it, this would be harder than the previous area. This platforming is pretty precise already. Yeah, definitely. There we go. No, what? <laughs> um. Okay, I, I guess that's doable. What? <laughs> that seems really tough. Okay, you just hold right. I was stuttering for no reason. So that actually took a few attempts. All right, at least didn't mess the final jump up. Ooh, I don't think I did that right. I want a single jump, right? Maybe get over that with the second jump. Don't know whether that would work or not. I'll have to check it out. I don't know. Do I need it though? Yeah, definitely. And. I can see that warp on the left, you know? Okay, so... I guess I found the secret. I'll just have to get there now. Yeah, definitely. This is tight timing. I have to jump as soon as I touch a star, I'm pretty sure. And then make it over that. Well, we... Okay, maybe not as soon as I touch a star, but... Also not too late. Or maybe I'm just hitting right too early. Yeah, I was not supposed to use my jump there, I'm pretty sure. Uh, so should I go over to the right first or maybe go to the left right away? I feel like both options would work. So I'll try this first. And there we go, okay. Yeah, that was... <laughs> I'm pretty sure you weren't able to even miss that. That's like really obvious. Alright, now we have this 
speed gimmick as well, and also high gravity here. Oh boy, <laughs> okay. So... Let's just see. <laughs> Not too sure, but I'm pretty sure that uh, that star will only give me like one jump to make use of. Can I even make it over there again? Guess I was just jumping too early for that. Ah, okay, this, this is also pretty tough. Dude, these secrets aren't joking around anymore. Like, I'm not safe anywhere there. Where do I have to land for that? Maybe I just have to get that uh, G. And that's all I need to do for now. That's definitely achievable. There we go, that's... That sense for gravity. <laughs> Good to know. Good to know. Oh yeah, I, I'm an idiot. I do get a jump from gravity flippers. There we go. Are you insane? What? Well, okay, I have a triple jump, but it's all still pretty tough. Wow, okay. Okay. Make it no uh, with the speed gimmick that's like I don't wanna say as hard as the 16 pixel, but it's hard to judge when you're gonna stop. I wish I could have gotten that. Now I can't even touch a star anymore, great. At least I'm making it over to the section of... More frequently, and... Ooh, another chance. Alright, got the secret spike. Why can't the war be here? Alright. So, the final thing, and I only have a double jump. So, how does that have to happen? How do I get into the warp with only a double jump? What? Am I missing something? I'm, like, actually confused. Um, get over there? Yeah, that doesn't work. What the hell? Uh, there's a double jump replication. <laughs> no! I thought it's a star in the background. <laughs> no! How did I miss that? I feel like I've spent days on that screen. <laughs> well, that definitely took way too long, but... Alright. Uh, I'm... Okay. <laughs> that... I can't believe I didn't recognize the jump pressure there. It's like so bad of me. Alright. This area messes with your physics so much.
Okay. <laughs> that was almost the first jump. But this map looks rather tiny. So I don't think there's that much more to go. Okay. That's pretty simple. And pretty much final jump already, okay. Of course. <laughs> I mean, what what did you expect? <laughs> oh well, it shouldn't be too tricky to get back to that point. Honestly, only... Yeah, really. This map is only three jumps if you think about it. Put together. You know, how did I miss it? All oh, right, and it goes on. Right now, we're officially being introduced to the gravity flippers. I feel like that should have happened first. Like introducing them in the stage itself before using them on a secret. But I mean, I, I, in my case, I just didn't realize that that's what they all do. <laughs> How did I get the height for that? Yeah, maybe I didn't do maximum full jumps. Wait, no, I can actually use the refresher here. Yeah, okay. And that uh, that are blocks that kill you. Those killer blocks look really upset, by the way. They're definitely having a bad day. Oh, I was preparing to go right, but I didn't quite get the uh, gravity flipper there. Alright, now with less spaghetti. What has to happen here? Probably just... Wait a second. Can't I just... Get to the warp from here? I'm pretty sure that's a skip that allows you to that the game allows you to do, but I'm not manly enough to actually do that. Let's just take the intended fruit. And I mucked it up either way. Alright, screw it, I'm going for the skip. Yes! What? <laughs> How did that work? Um, okay. Well, good. Dude, no mercy this area. No mercy whatsoever. Okay, this... I, again, didn't actually realize that there are refreshers. And that was wrong? Yeah. Ha! Huh. Alright. How though? Well then... <laughs> that, that was definitely not the way. To do things. I mean, that worked. I don't know how, but it did. And I'm happy. And that was it! Okay, so no clear screen actually. That's surprising. Well then, <laughs> I feel like that area, like in terms of how interesting the level design was, is pretty comparable to um, the one we played uh, before this. 
the only plus for this area are the uh, custom graphics and the music. I mean, uh, the graphics here are really like, just like based off um, not another needle game, but yeah, I feel like this area did a better job in like production value uh, with that, like actually including self-made uh, graphics, and they look pretty neat, honestly. My only complaint was that the jump refreshers didn't stick out uh, good enough. Like I, well, maybe it's just me being blind, but well, in my case, I actually never got to see them in time, so yeah. Let's check the review then, shall we? So, the area made by the boy? I'm just gonna... This stage has great visuals as well. Not all of the judges who are favorable towards the difficulty. Yeah, I can see that. However, and... However, and there are a few spots where the jump refreshers are hard to see. Hell yeah! Thanks, thanks for pointing that out. Due to blending in with the background, the secret room is also particularly brutal. Thank you! Actually, yes! <laughs> this is the perfect, uh, perfect review. Uh, this also describes how I feel about the area, pretty much. So yeah, um, last area for this, for this video. I feel like a... Ah! Wait, is it actually? Oh. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, um, alright. This guy, the uh, Purple Haze, scored, let's just get this over with. <laughs> uh, so, alright. Uh huh. Interesting. <laughs> alright, now I can't really comment about this, I mean. Should I should I skip I don't just for completion's sake, I guess. I maybe I can yeah, check out what the judges um, have changed for this area. Even though I don't really remember that much. But I mean big changes should I, I should be able to notice them. Oh yeah, the background, for example. It looks like way more pleasant. I remember, like, not liking the background for my area, so I'm really glad they changed it to a pleasant tone. As I'm doing really good so far, can I just say? God damn it! I mean, the only thing I'm really, like, I feel like I did a good job on was maybe the tile set. I think I was satisfied with that. Ah, I got rid of the corner. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Probably not the smartest jump to include. <laughs> it's like it's it's such a short save. How can I buff it? <laughs> That's like all I could think about. Like difficulty back then. Oh yeah, that that happens for whatever reason. Alright, yeah, not too bad so far. I think for this one you have to go quick or you're gonna die. Yeah, the reason for that was the. Um, when you. The, the, the cycle didn't really work out. Like the following cycles. So it's like only the first one is actually like pleasant to play. Uh, but I mean, that's probably not the smartest way to make the player go fast. Um, moving on. So I 
feel like I think I've watched many people play this area and not get like not do the puzzle how was how it was intended. So let's see if I can remember like the solution that I wanted for this. Because something about that switch on the right um, keeps breaking. So you touch it and it goes away. That's correct so far. Oh yeah, I don't know why they made this jump possible. Like... Sure. Into the button, switch us back. And, yeah, what happened? It was supposed to uh, go back down again since the player touched it. Well, it's not that important anyway. Okay, so get that down there. Push it a little bit over. And basically done. Alright. Hopefully. <laughs> well, this... This is somewhat of a choky jump. Yeah. Well... I'll make sure not to spit out any more errors like this though. <laughs> like, just based on difficulty. So, uh, the puzzle for this... I don't know if you can see it, but the buttons have um, different colors. So the pink one activates the pink button, which just removes uh, these two. But you actually need them if you want to get the secret for this area. So I'll push that a little bit over so I can get over. Uh, I actually forgot how this goes. I want to access the red box for now. So yeah, red box goes onto the red button. I can push this, whatever. Yeah, for now this is just in the way, okay. Oh, they removed the entire cherry circle! Nice, okay. That makes that part so much more chill. Um, I hope I did this right. Yeah, red onto red. And now it's actually not possible to finish the screen anymore. Now I want this block. Yeah, because... You saw what happens if the pink box touches the pink button on the right. Uh, the secret button basically disappears. So you wanna get that in onto like that, so you can drop the pink box now and get it all the way to the left. There. K3 sound effect because why not? And secret time. So, um, hard screen, by the way. Uh, yeah, I feel like many people complain about the screen for, for a good reason. Let's see if I can actually remember how to do this. Did they even nerf this? I'm not sure. Probably though. Oh wait, I forgot something, didn't I? Whoa! 
All the way back here. Yeah, this is a really, really long spin. Great. <laughs> I love how I'm doing like absolutely terrible right now. After like a first pretty decent attempt on this. Yeah, this secret must have been a pain to get. For everyone. God. Oh, Lisa's song's nice. Still, in my opinion. I mean, that doesn't make the, that scre the screen more enjoyable, though. So... Now this box still needs to be here, I'm pretty sure. So you can get over here, yeah. Oh. How did I think that that screen was a good idea? <laughs> oh, that was black to play. Alright. I have no idea where to go in this. Something like over here. Nope, don't drop down. I think this this rings a bell. Uh, it was not top because that'd be too obvious. Whoop! All right. I want to get to a part where I can drop it down and have the possibilities there. Wait, no, I missed it. How do you get there again? Oh, 
Oh, I'm just retarded? Okay. And, um... Right? It's like... The... Since you could see the secret there, you'd go right. So I feel like it's left. That was, that was certainly not correct. Was it? Oh god! <laughs> no, I'm <am> lost! <laughs> it was right! Oh no! I just... Oh god, I just trolled myself with that. Where am I now? What? What happened? <laughs> I'm lost! Where's the first screen? This is it, right? No. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> I don't want to talk to a spike. Oh, I like... I forgot that I... Yeah, it's actually also dark in here now. Cool. I would have deserved that, <laughs> by the way, if it would have happened. Um, wait, so where did I go the first time? I actually... Did this room change? Didn't, right? No, that's wrong. Oh, God. Here. Good. Wait, what? <laughs> no, that's wrong. Here, yeah. It's a secret! <laughs> Alright, pl please go right. Thank you. Um, yes, yeah, so this should be it actually. Hope I'm not gonna choke this. Oh! Neat. All right, new screen. New gimmick. Ah, oh no. Okay. I can't believe... They... Like, uh, I... I really don't like the stage anymore. Maybe it's because I played through it so many times that I got sick of it. Or like it's actually just bad. One of those two. I mean, could be both, right? Okay, yeah, so this screen is also a lot easier. <laughs> Oh, they squished that! <laughs> nice! Okay. Yeah, makes it so you don't fall off the block, block right away. So, uh, yeah, I was like, you have to single jump over this to keep your double jump and then uh, get over the laser. But that's like really sketchy. So now you just have to do that. Makes it easier. Okay. I mean, it's my fault for putting it there, but come on. <laughs> How do you choke on that? <laughs> All right, I, I deserve that one. All right, take two. And, okay. <laughs> Nice. So, romp room.
I, I tried to recolor them so they fit into the stage, but that uh, looks weird. Okay, this looks a lot easier than the original version. I didn't even know you can rush the first bump like that. And I think I just never tested it for the second one. But yeah, I guess I guess it works. Huh. I'm a good test player. Don't take that seriously, please. Yeah, okay, this screen isn't that bad if you know where to go. Why do I have a choke jump on like every single screen? Uh oh, it shoots, not jump, okay. Oh they removed the spike! This is very generous, okay. That helps a lot actually, okay. Nice! Okay, I remember the safe to be rather tricky. So. Oh, wait. I need ah! <laughs> no! That was, that was not great. I need to trigger him first. Ah. Oh. Okay, I can't shoot too soon there. I didn't learn a thing. Wait, why did I do that? Oh yeah, so I can actually get over there. I just remembered that you had to, but I didn't remember why exactly. Need um now only the lasers left. So one more time. Oh god, I I'll redo that. Whew, that was close actually. What? <laughs> oh, oh no! <laughs> Didn't do it right. Oh. Oh, okay. Well this is a lot easier then. That was the room that existed in this world. What? How did I... Actually... Well, okay, it makes sense since like the hitbox for the bullets is still the same. So it's not as huge as it looks. <laughs> but still, that, that should be possible, come on. At least I- <gasps> I was about to say at least I didn't miss that part. <laughs> and then- And then I missed it on the shot I didn't expect to miss ever. <laughs> it was beautiful. Alright. 
can't get past that. Wasn't there like also cheese for this? Oh, that's not it. I, I think it was like... No. Wait, that's not right. Select that. Then... Oh yeah, I think I didn't realize that you were able to push a block to the left here. Like, essentially... Yeah, it was like, I intended to play to go shoot the switch again and then loop around this section one more time. Lots of backtracking, I just realized. Um, but yeah, this actually saves a lot of time. And now you can just hold right. Nice. Choke jump. <laughs> Once again. It never stops, does it? And now this this was actually my favorite room that I've made. Yeah. Ah, I, I really like that. Okay. I can't go back, right? That'll just kill me? Or... Oh no, okay. Neat! So, that was that, <laughs> I guess. Um, so yeah. I'm not... I, I can't judge this, like... Basically, I... It was... it wasn't that good, okay? <laughs> I realized that, I do realize that. It was like way too hard when I submitted it. And I guess the design wasn't the most interesting. Most of it was just needle, really. So what we've learned from this area, I shouldn't be allowed to play spikes anywhere. Um, well, maybe some ideas were cool with like the... when I tried to make puzzle rooms, but even those did break in the end, so... Uh, I'm not really cut out for making areas, if you like. But it exists and we beat it, and that's all that matters. <laughs> so yeah, three areas as per usual, that should be enough to conclude this video, but let's check out the review. So, after the guy, most of the judges respected the amount of effort that went into designing the stage. Alright. Even while it had to be uh, massively nerfed <laughs> from its original version. Our main feedback is to try not to make super long puzzle segments with choke jumps in them. And also try not uh, try to make the stage cohesive with your use of gimmicks. Alright. Well, I like that actually. That's some pretty solid feedback, yeah. Yeah, the choke jumps are a problem. I do realize that. And, yeah, I guess people are just not really a fan of huge puzzle segments, yeah. Could definitely shorten them, if I do decide to make one or add one. And then the use of the gimmicks as well, okay, yeah. So I'll definitely try to improve, um, and by actually creating, like, fun to play areas that actually consist of interesting design as well. Escape Dimension didn't do that bad, honestly. So, yeah, I was pretty happy about the feedback I received for that game. So let's see if I'll be able to beat that project. Hopefully. So, yeah. That was the first half of uh, Tier 4. And, well, uh, well, we'll see what the rest of this stage has in store for us next time, though. Um, Hope you enjoyed.
another episode, even though it like it took ages to <laughs> actually come out. But yeah, I'll try to work on actually finishing this let's play. So it'll be like the very first uh, finished thing on my channel. That's on speed. But yeah, that concludes this video. So I'll see you at the second half of tier four. But until then, take care! Watch it pick up that now on that's your habitat I'm a first eye you never see that in it I hang in keep it out so on my bed on the back sky Boys and girls with everything between us and that's all was never seen Putting on a mask why you ask for the bed at all That's just that